The West Coast hit hard with a winter storm system that's now on track to make its way east across the U.S., just ahead of the busy holiday travel season. William Longinus has more. A powerful winter storm blanketing the West Coast with rain and snow this weekend. A heavy downpour combined with strong winds led to dangerous flooding in Southern California. At least two had to be rescued from rushing water in Orange County. Recent wildfires and drought also creating conditions for mudslides. Further north, as much as six feet of snow fell in California's Sierra Nevada region, creating near whiteout conditions that meant slow going for drivers. I mean, slippery, we have all-wheel drive. We saw a couple of people um, who were on the, you know, in the ditches and stuff like that, so quite a few. A 70-mile stretch of I-80 near Nevada was closed due to zero visibility. Chains were required to drive on many major highways. What do you think of all of this? Uh, I don't want to be here. <laughs> no, it's too much. I can't. The U.S. Forest Service issuing a avalanche warning for some mountainous areas, while snowfall was the source of headaches for some, for others, it was a huge hit. And we were amazed at the snow. You know, we were here last year and it was nothing like this. The National Weather Service warns the system could produce a blizzard across the northern plains this week and potentially spawn tornadoes further south in Oklahoma and Texas. The storm is expected to have a significant impact on travel ahead of the holidays. In Los Angeles, Wayne Lajeunesse, Fox News.